Okay, so we're here at the uh, Space Louis Vuitton in Venice, and uh, it's the eve of the Venice Biennale, and so the space here is just opening up, and I guess it's the first exhibition in this space. We have a uh, painting here, The Death of Othello, behind me, which has just been uh, cleaned up and uh, revitalized by Vuitton, and they invited me to kind of react to the painting. Uh, so it was this sort of uh, commissioned artwork that I made in reaction to this artwork. But really it was more of a uh, reaction to the chain reaction through history, a kind of sedimentary layering of uh, first the, uh, the story of the Moorish captain which preceded Shakespeare's play of Othello. And then this painting, which was done some hundred years after the play, and then thinking about what my reaction would be to that and kind of putting it in the uh, present tense. I guess the painting for me first uh, was a visual reaction. Uh, a very visceral reaction. So I reacted to the composition and the colors, uh, the scale, the fact that the figures were human scale, and the dynamic set up in the composition, um, which is kind of mimicked in the Shakespearean play. Othello, of course, is, is in his own atmosphere, this kind of green void you know, off to the side in the painting and, and over here you have uh, Desdemona dead and so of course this is a kind of snapshot of the climax of the play it's a kind of entrance into cinema in a way that you have everything happening at once so the whole play is told through this kind of collapse space. Othello was a returning general, uh, a victorious general, um, if there can be real victors in war. And so I read the play uh, as, a, as a kind of post-traumatic stress situation. So you have a, a warrior coming back, going from the heavy masculine position of being the uh, the warrior, the killer, and then trying to reintegrate into a peaceful society. And that was the key for me for the characters I used in, in my uh, interpretation. So I picked uh, three characters who were sort of either directly in battle or after battle and in fatigues or just out of the army. And I wanted to use three Othellos and three Desdemonas and for some reason it seemed that since there are so many interpretations I didn't want the piece to have like one of any of the characters plus there was a kind of triangle that keeps forming either imaginary or, or real triangulation in the play.